Um, I am listening. So DDT ran a show pretty similar to this uh, last year. And they actually, I think they've run one before that too. So yeah. DDT is owned by their parent company, right? It's a cyber agent, which is uh, kind of overviews. It's like a parent company to DDT and all its subsidiaries and all that. Sure. Mm -hmm. So you guys know who uh, Dino is, right? Dead yes, boy. Yes. Got resurrected so, by his dick. Yeah, yeah, my man. You know that, my man. So uh, this show, this was this entire show for DDT was lit. It was two and a half hours of them in this building, right? So it's the cyber agent building. This is they own this whole. Just, and this is just one match. N no, okay. So let me explain how it worked. This oh, is okay, this is okay. actually incredibly dope how they did it. So okay. they gave it. So when DDT runs shows like this. They usually have some sort of overarching story that whether it's just for sure. this show or whatever the case may be, it's almost like a story in itself. So okay. the point of this show was for Dino to make it to the top floor of this building <laughs> so okay. he can meet the cyber agent president, Susumu Fujita, and kiss him on the lips. <laughs> <laughs> and... Everyone in DDT is trying to stop him because they don't want DDT <laughs> to be released by Cyber Agent. So that's the story of the show. They start on the is the beginning of the show. It shows Dino and a bunch of other DDT wrestlers. He's got his own little team of DDT wrestlers that want to help him kiss the Cyber kiss Agent the president. president yes. <laughs> and there's the rest of the DDT roster, which is trying to stop him from kissing. Yes. So they start on the very bottom floor. Um, it's Dino. Uh, Yuki and like a few other people are on this bottom floor of this building and it starts yes. off by them walking in and they see so like the president of DET is Sanshiro Takagi and they see yes. him and he's like whoa you all you need to chill out what you're doing and like you're like <laughs> no he's like let's fight and then he's like okay well I guess we'll have to fight so he takes off his shirt and it's like a three on one match right now and then he <laughs> turns around he points to these two guards and they take their hats off they're DDT wrestlers in disguise. Oh, no. Yeah, they're, two, they're two police guards sitting downstairs in Son disguise, baby. Yeah, so first match. That's the first match of the evening. They ring the bell. There's a guy that runs in with the bell. He goes, ding, 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 and then he runs back out. <laughs> and uh, so Dino spends most of the time in the very first match just fucking dudes in the ass. That's kind of what Dino does. He just cool. pins them on the walls and then has sex with them. So there was this really good spot, actually, where Dino, <laughs> they run into this room where they're, like, doing construction. And it's like literally on the where like people are walking by on the outside and Dino pushes the dude against the wall and then starts ass fucking him against the mirror. So like everyone <laughs> walking by sees Dino ass fucking this dude as he's screaming. And then the dude reverses it and gets Dino oh, no. on the wall and sticks oh, no. a big rod up his ass. And oh, no. everyone sees this. So this is okay. Dino really shines in these matches. This is why they make them all about I can Dino because he's great. Um, so they go outside anyways. They go outside the building and they're wrestling out on the board. This fucking boardwalk here, where there's this ton of people that have nothing to do with the show are walking by. And um, of course, Dino finds uh, Gaijin and kisses him because that's just his thing. As um, you do. Yeah, and then like uh, Dino gets up and he breaks down all his pants and he's got his bare ass cheeks out and uh <laughs> sanshiro is about to get his head thrown into his ass and he stops him he hits him with a thousand years of death where he pokes him in the ass and he pokes him in the ass and then sticks his poo fingers in yuki's face and <laughs> that knocks him out it's only a two count though and that's I'm pretty much to, as you're as you're as you're uh, going through this i'm trying to reimagine it with wwe people that's so what i was going. doing i was doing the <laughs> thing so that's like, so which wrestler sure. will stick his hands not, in the pool. Yeah, I'm not ass. sure who I'm gonna assign to who yet. I'm trying to work it out. All right, so they get past the initial floor, right? After this whole match, um, Dino and them move on. They're moving on to the next floor after the after yes. the match there. So uh, yes. they move up. They actually finesse a key card from a worker that works there. They had oh, they had two girls with them from Tokyo joking, and <laughs> <laughs> and uh, they finesse this dude's key card, and they go into the second floor. And they're like, they walk it. They, so Dino kicks this door in. And it's just this huge room with desks and computers. And everyone's just fucking working. And it's a work day. And these people are all working. <laughs> Nine to five. Desks. Yeah. And uh, so they go in this room. And, like, the camera's, like, panning around the room. And, like, you, everyone's wearing suits. And they're working on the computers. And then there's two people in wrestling gear. And they're just working. They're sitting there on the computers just working. And they go around. The, they don't see him at first. And then Dino finds him. He's like, what the fuck? And then they get up. <laughs> <laughs> so it's um, Natsumi Maki and Yuki Aino from Tokyo Joshi. And they're sitting at this desk yeah. in full wrestling gear. Yuki is pecking at this calculator. She doesn't even have a computer. She's just sitting there pecking at a calculator. She's like, do, 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 do. And then uh, two other wrestlers from Tokyo Joshi are like, 
what the hell? And they're like, okay, we'll fight. So they fight. Um, so they try to stop them from going to the next floor. Um, and it's super dope. They wrestle all around this office and uh, they like use, they get up on a desk. They push all the, I was like, oh my God, they're pushing like real computer stuff like on the floor. I, I feel like, like they'll probably crazy. do that. I, I imagine they'll do a lot of weird like shenanigans like that in the WWE, but it obviously won't be as <laughs> long and intricate well, what if, as this one. Yeah, what if, uh, Dolph Ziggler started anal fucking dudes. Then maybe <laughs> we would be a little bit better. So can I ask you, uh, I is, this, is this is this done in one take, like one camera angle? Like yes. Following him the entire yes. Time? This is not <laughs> stop. That's brilliant. They That's literally brilliant. have downtime That's where they're crazy. going in the elevator talking, and then they go to the next floor, and then they <laughs> just do it. That's exactly That's... how it should be done. That's incredible. Yeah, it, it, from literally the bottom floor to the top. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so each floor is a different match. Then is that? How yeah, yeah. They are, they have okay. everyone on each floor trying to stop them from making it to the top floor. Um, <laughs> All right. So, so they have they cool. have this. Um, so they end up winning this match on the on the office. They do like a fucking Romero special on the desk, and airplane spins in the chairs, and they're brawling all over the room and stuff, and it's fantastic. Um, so they end up winning, <laughs> but the two girls stay behind because they don't have any more girls for them to you know they just stay behind. So they yes. go to the mm -hmm. next floor. And uh, Dino and Yuki, they, they head upstairs and they find this UFO catcher. So in Japan, like arcades have the UFO catchers where you, uh, they, the claw machines is what they're called in America. Yes. Um, so you press it once and you only have one chance to press it. So you press it once to the left and once up and then it drops, right? Yeah. yeah so yeah. they're playing this UFO catcher and then Bull James and Antonio Honda find them. And what the fuck? Bull, Bull James, James. yeah. Fuck? Fucking what Bull fuck? Dempsey from NXT. <laughs> I forgot about that guy. Yeah. So Bull is very adamant. He does not speak Japanese, by the way. So he is very adamant that he does not want Dino to ass fuck him. So he very much so does not want that to happen. So <laughs> he's just he, saying that. Yeah. He's out like, loud. yeah. He's just saying, no, Dino. And Dino is like, no. And he's like, no. <laughs> uh, so they push Dino and Yuki to the ground. And he's like, I'm not fucking fighting Dino. Uh, and so. Shunma and Akito come in, and then they have a match. So it's it's uh, Antonio Honda and Bull James and Shunma and Akito are taking the place of Dino. Um, yeah. And they have this. They of course they use this whole room with the UFO catchers and these these desks with their video games. Um, Akito gets Antonio Honda in a hammerlock, and Honda like sells it over to the UFO catcher, and then uses his free hand <laughs> to play the UFO catcher. <laughs> and then he does it once, and then he hammerlock reverses on Akito. And then, and then they, <laughs> he tries finishes it. <laughs> the UFO catcher, and they fail, of course. Um, but uh, anyways, uh, they tag out because it's a tag team match, and sh they, follow the they follow the fucking rules. They follow the rules, and uh, <laughs> they tag out. And Shunma and Bull James. Shunma goes up to Bull James, and he goes, uh, "You big, me small, no pro rest." <laughs> and Bull said, no, <laughs> "He said no pro rest," and he said, "Video game." And he points to it, and he's like, "Oh." So they sit down and play this video game instead, and then Bull James gets pissed off at the video game and just attacks them and starts beating the shit. Yeah, up. yeah. So <laughs> they they end up winning and they go to the next floor after that, which was I'm already like this, you know, this is incredible. That's crazy. Um, so this is the same this is the same floor where you saw the gif where he gets resuscitated on his wiener. They yes. <laughs> they brawl a little in the into the room a little bit, and then uh, Sanshiro Takagi puts Dino to sleep, and then he wakes up in uh he wakes up in the next floor where there's oh. this uh tv mascot and he is it's the fucking cyber agent like towers mascot um <laughs> like the actual one it's like a it's like a dude in a mascot suit <laughs> he's like a bird and so dino goes to attack him he's like no i don't want to i don't want to fight this thing so then pokotan the mascot of ddt comes and then we have a mascot match but it's not just a mascot singles match it's a penalty kick match so oh, there's a soccer goal <laughs> and then <laughs> Pokotan and Bird try to do penalty kicks. And of course they're in mascot suits. So neither of them can stop these it's from going. Kicks, yeah, yeah, they just cannot stop this from going in the goal. So it's a draw. So then they go into a singles match and then Pokotan gets his head knocked off. No! And, yeah, he gets his head knocked off. And then he runs at the bird to try to attack him. And the bird's beak hits him in the neck. And then oh, he no. falls down and he gets pinned. And they're like, oh. Yeah, and they're like, oh, man. And then, like, they're like, they're cool with it because Pokotan got cheated because his head fell off. So they go <laughs> up to this other floor in, in this other office and they have, like, th there's a stable called All Out in DDT. And it's okay. uh, uh, Konosuke Takeshita and Yuki Ino, which are just these okay. two badass, like, really good wrestlers. Yuki's yeah. a little comedy, but they have this tag team match. They they meet up with this girl, and that was the girl you saw me posting about a ton on Twitter. 
Um, yeah. The, yeah. So yeah. I so did. So she's. Yes, I yeah. did. Uh, Yuka Kuramochi is her name. They kind of just call Thank her Mochi. You. Uh, yes. Spell, uh, how do you um, uh, Her gimmick is that she has a <laughs> big the... ass. <laughs> <laughs> and she likes to show off her big ass. And everyone in God DDT bless. becomes infatuated with her big ass. So True. on this floor, she uses her powers of her ass to infatuate everyone in the match. Because she was told if she could stop Dino on this floor, that she would get an apartment in this building. And she would be able to do anything <laughs> she wants in that room. That, right. did, not, that did not work. Wow. <laughs> Takeshita <laughs> and Yuki uh, are immune to the ass cheeks. And uh, they're fine, and they move How on. How is that possible? I That's don't unrealistic. know. Dude, them, them <laughs> cheeks were cheek, and I said, That's damn, this is nuts, bro. I love wrestling. Probably the best wrestling match I've ever seen. Uh, <laughs> so <laughs> after that, this is it's a nine-floor building. This building is fucking oh, God, huge. Oh, God, damn. So they I wonder go why in, it was two hours. Holy yeah, God. yeah. They go to the next floor, and they have this wide-open off uh, like office space, and they have a tag team match this time, but it's a fucking hardcore match this time. Oh, and it's uh, Hiroshima and Mal, and they're in this tag team match, and uh, – so it's a hardcore match. So this time they like before in the office they were just kind of fighting around the office and kind of doing shenanigans. This time they were grabbing yeah. keyboards and shit and smashing it over each other's heads Ooh. and doing like moonsaults onto like monitors and chairs Hell and yeah. yeah, it was dope as hell, man. It was awesome. Um, and and of course they end up winning that one and they move on to the to the next floor. Um, this time there is no match. There is uh, a wrestler named Okuda, but Okuda is upstairs with an employee that he is holding hostage and he has a bomb. <laughs> he has a oh, bomb fuck. and a lighter, and he said fuck? he's gonna blow this whole fucking building up. So, <laughs> like, is it like a cartoon-looking stick of dynamite yes, thing? It is oh, a stick yes, of dynamite. That rules. Dynamite, and he's got dynamite stuck <laughs> on his jacket and stuff too. So, they, oh, so he's all strapped up. Yuki and Takeshita and and just all these dudes just drag. They get him off the employee and drag him into a room, and then yeah. Yuki's closing the door as Dino's looking on in the door and. and He's speaking in Japanese, but I'm pretty sure it was, I'm sorry, I love you. He closes the door on Dino, and Dino's banging on the door, and all you hear is, boom, do, 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 boom. And Dino starts crying. Everyone's fucking dead in that room. They all start mourning the death of all their friends who died in this bomb. And, well, Dino said he, did, he didn't want to have his friend's death in vain, so he's going to keep on moving, and they get to the ninth floor. This is where... Susumu oh, Fujita is. Brother. They finally reach the top of the building, and I'll be damned. Damnation is up there. That's a stable in DDT. They were hired by Fujita to stop Dino from kissing them. No. Yes. So the surviving me members of Dino Goon <laughs> face, <laughs> they face damnation. And Sanshiro Takagi is here, and he's trying to stop Dino too. Oh, so shit. how does he get through? Yeah, there's a there's there's a whole bunch going on here. Um so like this is a death match also. Um Daisuke is a, uh he's a wrestler that's in Damnation. You might have seen him. He uses a sword or he did and they lost a sword and then got pissed off okay. cuz he lost yes. a sword. Yes. So <laughs> yeah, all right. So he rules by the way. Um I, and he I tried think. in the very beginning of the match to stick to catch his head into a microwave and blow his head up. <laughs> that didn't work. Um and they do I a wish bunch the of crazy Big Show shit. Show was more like this. That's what I'm saying. Imagine episode six. Big Show tries to stick someone's head in a microwave. So, it's within the context of the show. It's well, maybe the show should be about Dino trying to kiss some lips. So <laughs> the Dino Show Show. Yeah, that yeah. would that would actually be really good. You know, he's the gay anal champion. So, anyways, they set up a ladder and this table, and they do fucking. Takeshita climbs a ladder and slams his head to the roof because there's not room for his head. And he <laughs> goes to the table and they're just going nuts. This whole match, they set up like a human centipede spot and they're going crazy. Oh, of course. And at the end of the day, the time limit hits in the match. And no. draw. And no. Dino fails at his mission once again. No. As the cyber agent president escapes at the last second. It's like a fucking video game. It's like Golden Eye or something. Escape? It's a two hour He just draw? leaves. He's not there anymore. He he goes to find oh. him and he can't find him. He's not there anymore. Oh, no. So in the last match, they came to a draw. They couldn't get the win they needed. And since they failed, there was another thing that had to happen. Since they failed, someone no. had to get a kick from Nascala, which you guys might know as the guy who faced uh, Floyd Mayweather in that random Japanese. Oh fucking. yeah, the kickboxer. Yeah, yeah. So he's a shoot fighter, and he, so you had to take a shoot kick from this guy. Oh. And uh, Kurochan, oh. which is this weird fucking pervert in this green outfit, he was in this match too. By the way, he's just hanging out. 
Uh, okay. it, yeah. Um, he had to take that kick. And dude, he kicked the living shit out of that dude. Like he, <laughs> when I saw that kick, I was like, "Oh my god!" His he kicked him in the ass cheeks. His ass cheeks are gonna be so sore. <laughs> that was bad. Then at the end, they have a scene where Dino's like crawling down this hallway, and there's this picture of the cyber agent president at the end of the hall, and he's like, oh. he starts crying. Yeah, he starts oh, crying, no. and then Poco Tan comes out of nowhere, and he talks to Dino, <laughs> and then they go off, and they leave the country, and they become rich, and they live a happy life. <laughs> the end.